Good morning, YouTube. It's Friday morning. This is the 2nd of October, and I'm thinking we're coming to the close of Finish It Friday, but I plan to keep playing. Um, I may continue this uh, through the October, November months so that I can get ready for a couple of craft fairs um, in December. But I have two things that I hope to accomplish today. So the first of those is a pocket letter. I joined Pocket Letter Pals a couple of weeks ago. And I am swapping with a pal and we are doing an autumn theme. So this is as far as I've gotten. I've got some Hobby Lobby um, leaves up top and I have actually adhered these on already and started here with some sunflowers that I've stamped. These are the little trinkets I've gathered. I've got my tea. I've got a domino that I've altered. I won't share that yet. I'll share that at the end. I have my crafty Irina paper clip embellishment. I have my Scrap the World Tamika book charm. I've got a couple of, I'm pretty sure these are Elizabeth Beatty Bomb Bombs flower embellishments that I've made within the last week. Since getting my fuse I've been fuse crazy. So this is a sunflower shaker that I've made as well as, and this is kind of a combined, I'm pretty sure that um, Tamika with Scrap the World, um, she does shaker cards so well and I just um, have a kick out of making little embellishments. So this one at least matches the theme color. Sorry about the glare there. Put it down there. And I told my pal that I was going to give her a taste of a Colorado Rocky Golden Autumn. So I've got the start of that with a postcard here that I'm going to do something with. So there's that. The post office closes at 930. Therefore, this pocket letter has to be done, wrapped and ready to go. Alrighty, so there's that. And then the other little goodie that I started, um, I'm not sure if you've watched any other of my videos, but I love altering, especially mini albums using um, unique boxes and just recycling or upcycling the boxes. So this was a Pentex pin box it had 12 pins in it, and I love the shape. I liked that it was, it's, it's about three inches across, and about five and a half going down. And I just thought this would be so cool to make a small mini. I joined mini album scraps, and my first scrap went in the mail, and it's been received, so that's pretty fun. But I just, I love this area of crafting. So I've already put in two signatures. I've sewn them in. I've learned that I punch holes the way I cut, <laughs> crooked, but I'll cover that up probably with some lace. And I've already put in pockets. Uh, this is a paper that I got at Hobby Lobby. It was a 12 by 12 sheet, and it's that faux leather look. I'm not sure how they do it, but I love the paper. And so I've actually got signatures in. I've got most of the pages decorated, a few, there's a paper clip embellishment. I really wanted this not to be an alligator. It still turned out to be one, but I think that's more because of the, just sewing in the signatures. But there's a pocket in the back. I've already put some tags. So this is what I hope to do today. I just came up with, not this, not it's not my original idea, but I think it'll be so cool. I want this mini to look more like something Amelia Earhart would carry. So not necessarily masculine, but not necessarily a whole bunch of flowers on top. So I remembered seeing 
I'm pretty sure it was Tammy Tuttero, but it may have been someone else on the Tim Holtz design team. They used grunge paper and they created a belt out of the grunge paper. And it's a gray color, but using alcohol inks and distress inks, uh, they dyed it so that it looked like faux leather. So that's what I'm going to do. I have some grunge board downstairs. I've got embossing folders. I've got plenty of uh, autumn, fall, brown alcohol inks. So hopefully this little pup will have um, some type of closure and covering uh, to make it complete. I, and then I'll do a video, a separate video for mini album scraps. So those, it's pretty aggressive, but hopefully that's what you'll get to see this evening. Have a great Friday, and we will talk to you soon. Bye.